7.24 on Laser 103.3's Morning Moose Show at 244-1033. You can text us at 49330. But it's time for my, what are we calling this, the Moose Taste Shocker? Something like that? Sure. All right, let's get it on. Basically what it means is uh, I had a head injury uh, three months ago or whatever, and ever since then I can't smell or taste anything, and I'm getting fed up not being able to do so. I'm missing out on life, I feel. I'm starting to get a little depressed, so what are you doing, Amy? Are you sampling it? Really? Uh, so every day about this time, we're trying a new food item uh, to see if it can instigate my sense of smell and taste to come back. Mostly the taste. And each day, the guys have given me a blind food item to try. First day was wasabi. Yesterday was a spice called alum, which is used for pickling and is really bitter. How did that work out for the rest of the day? Because it was kind of hanging with you during the morning. It was. It kind of hung there in the tummy. For the rest of the day, more so than the wasabi, which is a little surprising. So today, let's uh, let's try this new item. I don't need to close the my eyes. The alum, I can still feel on my tongue. Really? Today. Wow. It I, feels like I burnt my tongue. It's gone now for me, but yesterday, all day, my stomach was feeling a little, uh, a little in, in, uh, weirded out by it, shall we say? All right, it's a big plastic cup. It's got like a bluish, greenish fluid. It almost looks like pool water. Oh, it is. You guessed it. No, it's not. No, this one's actually uh, listener-inspired. Oh, this was suggested by a yeah, listener. Yeah, somebody okay. on TXT sent it in. I can't remember who did it, but okay. uh, it is their idea. Let's, well, let's try give to it smell a shot. it. Let's give it a shot. Let's give it a smell. <sighs> Nothing. Nothing? I want to get my nose right up to it. <sighs> <laughs> clear the Clear the snorter. I can't smell anything. No? Nothing. Can you smell it when you oh, smell it? Oh, yeah. yeah. God, I'm so tired of that. I want to smell my farts again. <laughs> no, you don't. You don't. <laughs> They're so awesome. High five. Farts. All right, here we go. I'm going to give it a taste. It almost tastes sweet. There's like a sweet tinginess to it. Really? Can, is this something I can consume? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And won't get sick? No. That's not bad. You can taste it? You can taste it? I can't taste it. I can tell that it's sweet. How do you how can you tell it's I don't know. sweet? It's weird. It's like like you see a car from the outside, you know it's a car, but you don't know inside it has a killer sound system. Make sense? Does that work? Anyway, this is not bad. <laughs> this isn't like uh, antifreeze is it? Because antifreeze is sweet. Oh, would antifreeze kill you? <laughs> Seriously? No, oh, because we because we agreed it'd be food items. Yeah. Yeah, we agreed. You just committed a class A felony, bitch. Man, I forgot. <laughs> no. All right. So what is it? What am I drinking? Lime Jello. Lime Jello. Yep. Oh, that's good. Yeah, it is good. What, so I think it's interesting that you were be, you're able to tell bitter, spicy, spice, and sweet, and sweet and salty. But, I can tell when these things are going on. But you can't taste it. I can't taste it. But you can't like. I can tell it's blank, but I can't taste it. That's weird, and you can't smell it, and that has a has a distinctive smell. You know, when you smelled it, you kind of cringed at it. Oh, it's because I just didn't want you to think it was going to be yummy. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. good acting. Thank you. The Oscar goes to. I know. So lime jello powder. Yes. So why you? Why did this guy suggest it? Because it it's kind of, I mean, it's a different taste. It's very sweet, and it's you know it's concentrated because you'd usually spread that out over, you know, how far. Okay. Yeah, so, I guess so. A couple cups of water. I think the thing is, like, I don't have the taste... Um, excuse me, let me back up. The taste buds are there, and I think they work. I think the doctor said it's my, uh, my yeah, brain. Yeah, someone, one of the guys in our building said if your taste buds work, like, if you can tell, like, bitter or something sweet, it's working. It's just not processing to the brain. Right, right. Okay. Well, that's good news, though, because it sounds then like at least you're one step closer. It's not like everything tastes like cardboard. Right. So, I mean... Not a bad little taste shock today. Yeah, I'm, I'm actually you're pleasantly surprised. But you know what that means. Tomorrow.